Good morning. Good morning. Hello and welcome back. I hope you guys are having a wonderful morning. Man, what a beautiful morning in Tucson. Let's see here. It's about 72 degrees outside. But humidity is pretty high though. It's about 60% humidity. So a little sticky out there. Okay, it's about just about 8 a.m. in here. So this morning, we're going to brew some V60. Okay, by the way, the V60 has been around for a long time. And this is mostly widely used. And also, if you go to a lot of competitions, the V60 has been the dominator entire field. Okay, so V60 has been really fantastic, uh, the brewing method. But here's big but the, it's all about the techniques. Okay, all about the techniques because, I mean, I, I, okay, so here's the deal. So a couple of weeks ago, I went to, not a couple, it's last month. It's been last month. So I, uh, I competed in uh, two, uh, 2023, the Brewers Cup Championship. But you have to go through the prelim. So that happened in uh, last end of August. Okay, end of August. Uh, I was using, you know, triclet with a modified method. You know, I spent a lot of time on it, developed that recipe. But the winner of that event was, I'm going to big shout out to Yuri from California. She was using just plain V60, okay? Nothing special, just the V60. And the her technique is so simple. Uh, she showed me how to do it. Uh, she just, she bloomed it first. And then second pour, that's it. So she was using 1 to 15 ratio. So 15 gram in about 45 grams of water as a blooming kind of a one to three uh, ratio there and then she wait about 45 seconds and then second that's all it takes uh, pretty tight circle kind of in and out okay go up to she she introduced the water for 225 gram that was it she won that event okay extremely simple recipe she won again I mean she makes everything look so simple, but the, that's the technique. It's all about the technique. She did not use any kind of fancy tools like I did. I mean, very, very simple. So I'm trying to mimic her recipe this morning. The, I mean, not the recipe, but her technique. So again, I'm going to be using my K Plus from Easy Presso. So this grinder has been fantastic. So this one does a great job. Okay, great job uh, with espresso. So this morning I'm gonna to put to the test on V60. It should be fine, okay? I think it should be great. By the way, uh, let me know in the comment section so how many of you actually enjoy V60. If you are watching my channel, most likely you have some kind of espresso machine at home, most likely Brista Express or Pro. But you know, how many of you make V60? Yeah, I'd love to hear comments there. But meantime, Let's brew some coffee, okay? So I'm using coffee from the Good Brothers Coffee here. So this is a dark roast, okay? This is dark roast. It's called liquid amber. But man, the V60, it's gonna be dark and rich. If you guys are into like black coffee, so this one should be really good. And also, you know, lighter coffee too. Okay, I got, I'm just gonna 15 gram. All right. You know, I'm I'm curious. I'm gonna find out how long it's gonna take to grind 15 gram on K plus. Because the last time it took me about a minute to grind 18 gram on my espresso. So I'm hopefully cut that down by half we'll see okay I'm just gonna put the coffee beans in there start the timer here we go by the way if you are just joining us for the first time welcome to live streaming now, I try to go live anywhere between like 7 a.m. to 2 p.m. Okay. There's, there's no set time. 
uh, you know, whenever I'm available. We go live for like 10 to 15 minutes. Just hang out. Okay, about 30 seconds to grind 15 gram. So yeah, that's not too bad. It's painless. Uh, also, great thing about the K Plus, that's twist up. Kind of like magnetic here. So, so far so good. Okay, I'm really enjoying the coffee grinder. Okay. All right, so this is the darker roast. So I'm not gonna use a boiling hot water. So I mean, that's pretty hot right now. Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna, here, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna boil it. And I'm gonna wait about maybe like 30 seconds after. Okay. And then, hold on, you know what? I'm gonna set the, I'm gonna set the stage, okay? Because unfortunately I don't have kind of an overhead camera, it'd be nice, but I don't have that, so I'm just gonna wing it. Hold on a second here, folks. Okay, here we go. Hopefully this one do the job. I got my B60. The water is boiling. I'm just gonna shut it off for now, okay? I'm using the timer scare, it's called Nano. Just gonna... Got my B60 paper here. So paper, I'm just like to fold it. Again, I'm... I know sometimes people get overwhelmed by the how many steps involved with the V60, but I personally, w once you get hang of it, uh, pretty simple. Okay, I'm just gonna wet the paper, uh, <coughs> remove the filter, the paper filter taste. Hold on. Okay, I wonder I can get you guys better view from the top. I'm just gonna up my production value here, but uh, we're not gonna get there yet. Okay, not today, but you're gonna get there someday. Okay, hopefully you guys can see it. All right, there we go. <clears throat> I'm just gonna toss up this water. I'm gonna be doing, again, the one to 15 ratio. <clears throat> okay, here we go. I'm just gonna put the coffee in. 15 gram, exactly. Uh, this is about medium fine, okay? And the uh, K plus uh, grind size number eight. Okay, number eight for the grind size. Just like to use my finger to put a little bit of hole there. I'm just gonna go <clears throat> 45 grams of water. For the initial blooming phase. All the CO2 is releasing right now. You see that? All the CO2 is releasing. I'm gonna wait about 45 seconds. And so here, <clears throat> here's the key. As you can see, there are a lot of activities going on. I'm gonna, again, I'm gonna wait to 45 seconds. And the, here's the, the techniques involved. Okay, I'm just gonna go tight circle. And I'm just gonna go in and out. In and out. Out. And then go in 225. That's it. Uh, it's gonna be under two minutes. It's gonna be under two minutes for the coffee. More like minute and 40 seconds. 
very simple easy recipe pretty much it just under two minutes there yep minute and 50 seconds 40 seconds all right let's try that uh, let's try this coffee <clears throat> okay man this smell is wonderful all right let's give it a try okay by the way if you are just joining us for the first time welcome to live streaming so right now I'm in my kitchen okay my kitchen in my house the reason why I like to do it from here because man my internet is much better at home than my work okay so it comes to I need that upload speed I mean at work imagine I want a computer shop okay computer shop has pretty sorry internet connection so cheers guys happy Wednesday here we go cheers it smells great it smells very I can actually taste that, that dark chocolate Man, yeah, wonderful. Cheers. Clean. Okay, so if you had to think about coffee, this is like the coffee tastes like. <clears throat> I mean, if someone asks you, what's that coffee taste like? You know, I mean, kind of like remind me of that coffee candy. I know you guys, I mean, personally, I love that coffee candy, the hard candy. This tastes just like that. Okay. Uh, except the sugar okay and because I do enjoy the lighter roast like very fruity uh, the floor as well but sometimes I just like the just dark black coffee man clean well balanced uh, kind of like light body to it and it's like more like light to medium body to it think of it as like <clears throat> like two percent milk yeah body to it sweet okay i have to say it's pretty sweet as well so this is one of my the favorite coffee from my buddy the good brothers coffee the brand so uh if you haven't tried his coffee i do have the 25 percent coupon code so make sure to take advantage of it i think i'm the only person as uh so, so he gave me that code for the my viewers about two years ago two and a half years it's been a while he's still active so yeah make sure take advantage of that coupon code uh hun 25 so yeah he doesn't know but yeah hopefully just use it okay anyway uh i'm, I'm gonna check the live chat here what's going on on our live chat this morning hold on i'm just gonna check out the live chat we have uh is that dan uh danny's in the morning danny mentioned i'm using the v60 with k max getting great results so far loving the grinder uh my v60 recipe is pretty simple yeah i mean again trying to simplify okay if you can rain uh have you compared pour over versus air press long block from uh yes i did okay man uh, comes to comes to comparing my brisa express or pro man over the years i compare pretty much everything so yeah i do have the video on that somewhere but you know what make maybe we can make another one it's not a big deal so yeah we, we can just make some new videos but uh this recipe again so simple just two pour that's it just blooming phase and they put the rest of them on just make sure think about the technique all right tight circle go in and out and finished in so uh, you're gonna have some good results 
anyway i hope you guys are having a wonderful morning and uh, we're gonna do some more uh session later today at the shop okay hopefully you're gonna have some better connections all right see you guys next time